1979, Tulsa, Oklahoma, in USA. My father and the Lord and five of us went to Connecticut camp meeting. There, for the first time, I saw the lame walking in her presence. I saw healings. I saw miracles. Ah. I was a young Christian then. I've been reading about it. We'll be having testimonies of healings, all right. But I, I mean, I saw this raw demonstration of the power of God. Ah. So I made up my mind. I'm not going back to Nigeria without meeting this man. They said it is impossible to meet him. I said, I will meet him. Where there is a way, there is a way. To cut a long story short, one way or the other, he gave me an appointment. As soon as those of us who went from Nigeria, we were many from other denominations. As soon as they heard that I have an appointment with him, they jumped on the bandwagon. We got there and they told me he can only give you 15 minutes. I said, ah, that's enough. When we got to his office, before I could say anything, the man asked, and what can I do for you? And the people who went with me began to ask for all manners of things. One said, Sir, I want you to give me permission to begin to distribute your books in Nigeria. Okay. The second one said, I want permission to be distributing your tapes in Nigeria. Okay. Another one said, I want permission to be distributing your magazines in Nigeria. Okay. Finally, he came to me, the one who booked the appointment. I said, young man, what do, uh, what do you want? I said, sir, what I want is everything that is in you, that makes you you. That is what I want. He was shocked. He said, what do you say? I repeated myself. He said, okay. He called the secretary in. And said, this one want books, give him books. This one want tapes, give him tapes. This one wants a magazine, give him a magazine. And then he said, they should all move out. Then he turned to me. I said, young man, kneel down. I went on my knees. I saw his hands coming towards me. That's all I remembered. By the time I woke up, I was on the floor. He was kneeling beside me, his two hands on my head, and he was praying the Holy Spirit furiously. When I got up, I knew I got what I wanted. What do you want? Stand on your feet. Lift your voice to the Almighty God and tell Him what you want. Just ask God, ask God. And pray as if your life depends on Him. Open your mouth and cry to Him. What you are thirsty for is what you will get. What you thirst for, that's what you will get. <laughs>